It's hard enough to watch what you say when you're speaking, but at least you've got inflection on your side. When you're writing, especially in the shorthand way that many do in emails and in texts, ambiguity often slips right in. Like in the title to this video, Do You Make This Mistake in English? A student might think that it refers to a gaffe made during English class. But more seriously, and to the practical point, be very careful in connection with email and text communication in the course of your practice. Not only because the recipient might misunderstand, but also because with few restrictions, that communication is discoverable in a legal dispute. Take the very simple text message, just want you to know that I spoke with Sally about diverting drugs. Is the sender of that text message a concerned supervisor or a loose-lipped co-conspirator?